Here in this tub, we have a bunch of lightning stones and we're gonna cut them open. A lightning stone is actually just a nickname for septarian. These are from Michigan and they were sent to us by Dutch so we could cut them open and find even more beautiful details inside. I'm really excited to see what's going on. So let's head out, fire up our 10 inch lapidary saw and get to cutting. So here is our first three cuts. I haven't looked at any of them. And these are some of our smaller pieces, some of the not so fancy pieces like stuff like this. And uh, just so you guys know, we are gonna be cutting this in this video. We're gonna be cutting it last and we're gonna be cutting it right down the middle, right there. And let's check this one out though. Oh, we caught a little bit of that. And some of these ones, they, they were kind of like, I'm not even sure exactly where to cut that. We're learning. I've never cut this stuff before, ever. Well, oh, that is so pretty. Look at that change in color. It is so beautiful. Ooh. Well, these were the ones that I picked first because they're like, in my opinion, weren't the, some of the best pieces. So <laughs> I'm super excited with how they turned out. Let's grab a couple of the nicer, medium-sized pieces and cut those. I did sneak a little peek at this one and I think you're gonna like it. <laughs> How crazy is that? That is so beautiful. And I think I forgot to mention this white stuff inside here. That's calcite. This is what I'm talking about. Look at how beautiful that is. That beautiful calcite shooting through the matrix like lightning. This is super cool. I, I think I'm gonna polish this one for sure. So I am over the moon with that last cut. So I wanna grab a couple of the other big ones and cut those ones now. Let's do this one and this one. excited with how this one turned out <laughs> oh that's so beautiful so sweet kind of can sneak a peek on this one here kind of kind of looks like maybe a bit of a dud oh no it's not it's got some stuff in there it's just right there where it was peeking out let me rinse this off real quick gosh you see where it gets the nickname lightning stone from <laughs> That is so sweet, man. And these are very soft, you know, it's like matrix, host rock. It just cuts through it so quick. So like these ones took about a minute to cut through. So up next on the chopping block, we're gonna cut these last three small ones. Then we're gonna get into three medium to large-ish ones. And then last, I got this really awkward awkward piece here and uh, we got big poppy right here I'm really excited about this one yeah let's get these little guys first though
me rinse these off quick. All right, I did not sneak any peeks on any of these. I guess I just saw that right there. Wow. <laughs> Nothing going on with that. Let's see what this guy with that unconventional cut looks like. Eh, not as cool. Not as cool, I think, as the others, but it's still, uh, still pretty. All right, this one I'm really excited about. I hope it's good. <laughs> really? That's insane. Nothing. <laughs> I didn't expect that at all. Well, that makes me really nervous, actually, for this guy. That there's nothing going on on the inside, and then we're going to have to make other cuts. Hey. We'll see, huh? <laughs> Alrighty, well, I'm going to make a couple more cuts on that just to see if it gets closer, if it makes a difference, but also cut uh, these ones too. to shut my heater off. I want to rinse this off and <laughs> take a closer look. That's awesome. Glad we got another good one. Gosh, I love the coloring in, in there. Even this brown is so beautiful how it gets dark and it's lighter. <laughs> that is so sweet. I, I don't know what to think about this one. It's got these little lightning strikes kind of going in every direction. I want to go surface area, so I'll probably go right through there. We'll do this funky one first though. Oh yes, that is a good one. That looks like a spider. It's a wood tick. <laughs> I can't get away from him. It's a little wood tick. That's so funny. This guy right here. There's so much going on. Yes. <laughs> Let me rinse that off. That's so pretty. All these, every single one of them, everyone you're ever gonna find ever. They're all going to be individually unique. You're never going to get two the same. That's why I get so excited, because they're just all so different, all so unique. Let's cut this, uh, this awkward one right here. I'm going to call it as a super stud. I bet it's going to be crazy. I hope I'm right. <laughs> Even if this is a dud inside, <laughs> I cut it perfect. Cut it perfectly. Check this out. <laughs> yeah. All right. Moment of truth. Yes. <laughs> it's awesome. So cool. Let me just give this a little rinse. So pretty. Look at that. Golly. Cool, cool, cool. Let's get that big guy going. Oh, I'm so torn on what's it gonna be inside. Is it gonna be muddy with nothing going on? Or is it gonna be insane? You can see that these, they're going towards each other. Oh. <laughs> it's the right height, we'll do it. Ah. Hopefully, 
<laughs> and I say hopefully because I hope we don't have to cut more layers off the sides. I'm worried that it's going to be nothing going on on the inside, but let's see. Ah, oh, I was right. Ah, we got to cut it again, which is okay. We'll cut through some of this mud here. And uh, we'll get closer to the lightning. We can do it. We can do it. I got through the cut, but looks like we had some blowing out right here on the end. It's so hard because it's about as tall as the blade. So we lost some pieces here, which is kind of a bummer, but the slab right here that I made, that's intact. So if it's good, uh, <laughs> I'm not going to lie, is what it is, right? I wish it was more through. It's still really beautiful. You know, I could take cut of this and make something from it, but I just, I worry that if we do that again with this side, that we're not gonna hit it like I'd like to. And if I get too thin, it's gonna blow out and fracture. And I don't wanna ruin, cause I feel like I kinda ruined this right here. It is what it is, but I don't wanna ruin this. I think that's beautiful. And I can, now that it's kinda flat, I can sit it on a display, put it like that. So I think I'm just gonna leave this one for now. Maybe I'll mess with that at a later date, but I'm gonna leave it right now. Let me get all this cleaned up. I'm freezing cold <laughs> right here, so I'm gonna head inside. One of my favorite sayings is, hindsight is 2020, and a fool is blind. Now, if I would have known that the last one that we cut had absolutely nothing going on on the inside after its first cut, I would have left it alone. Because out of all those beautiful septarian nodules that Dutch sent me, that one was my absolute favorite. And if you've watched some of our other cutting videos, you know sometimes it doesn't go like we would hope. And another one of my sayings that I like to say is, that's the cost of exploration. <laughs> it just is what it is. And we can salvage a display piece out of this, so at least there's that. But I do feel really bad that this piece right here got broken up. I am sad about that. But you gotta take risks, and I don't like playing it safe. It's fun to cut stuff, even though uh, it doesn't work out the way we like it sometimes. <laughs> Yeah, we had a lot of really beautiful cuts though with all of these sweet lightning stones and my favorite one is this guy right here. I think that is spectacular. I'm so happy with that and if this was the only good one we got, I would have been happy still. <laughs> so awesome. So I want to say a huge thank you to Dutch for sending all those beautiful lightning stones over to me so I could cut them and share it all with all of you. I hope you all enjoyed it. Thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed it, leave a thumbs up, leave a comment, let me know what you thought, and we'll see you next time. Bye.